So Funky Friday just came out with another new update. This one's going to be a smaller one throughout the week, which is going to be good. Maybe two updates a week again. That'll be really cool. But make sure you guys smack the like. Don't forget to subscribe. You start code attack and let's cover everything in this update here. So what's new as of August 19th? They've added in versus Lavender. They re-added versus a goatee. Pretty insane. They actually re-added a goatee again. They re-added Orenji's Parasite Remix, the Lavender and the Goatee animation, Step Mania Arrow Skin, and the Tag Seal has ended. So, pretty short update. Let's go check out the new animation. The Lavender animation is made by Celsius and it is going to cost us 600 points. Pretty cheap animation. Let's go do a short case of it. This is what the animation looks like on idle. You're like floating around. You got left, down, up and right looks pretty cool man you're like floating in mid space like a superhero here's some gameplay with it It's a nice and pretty simple animation. It also doesn't break the bank as well. 600 points is gonna be a really good deal for that one. So a great job by Celsius right there. And of course, it did re-add the Goaty animation as well. You do have to buy it once again, just keep in mind. So 600 points. I guess we can showcase it again, why the heck not? They might have done some changes to it, you never know. This is what the Goaty animation looks like once again. Doesn't look like much has changed since they removed it. Left, down, up, and right. Looks pretty much the same. So it's good that it's back again, finally. It's pretty insane, man. Honestly, I'm really surprised that they finally added in the Goaty mod back again. That's really great that they were able to like work with the creators and everything like that. And, you know, and I'm glad that they were able to sort that situation out and everything too. So if we go to the custom arrow customization here, we do have a new set of Step Mania arrows. So we got the regular one and then we got the wide version as well. Let's see what the wide version looks like. So this is what the wide arrows look like. And then if we switch over to the normal ones, that's how the normal ones look like. So, I'm not sure exactly what the difference is. I guess it's just the color of the outline that changes up a little bit. Which is cool, I guess. But the only change I can notice this is just the outline color changes, you know? It goes from a white outline to like a black outline for the wide version. Which, I guess for some people, it helps better. I'm not really sure. Oh, never mind! The trails actually are a little bit different too. You notice that trail? was a little bit different right there. That's actually pretty cool. Yeah, it just really ha it, it, it has a pretty cool trail effect to it. I'm not gonna lie. It does look pretty cool. A little bit different than the other ones, actually. That's pretty much everything for this update. It's gonna be like a mini update. Let's go to some public servers, check out some of the new songs on the video. So we got three songs. Versus Lava is gonna be in between the co-mod and also the Versus Mammy demo. And we got Dream Natura, Nature, and also Tempting. I'm not really sure what that uh, order is for this mod, to be honest. I've never even heard of this mod, to be honest. But we'll play some Tempting first. So yeah, here we go. Some Tempting first. I've actually never heard of this mod before. This is the first time I've ever actually ever heard of this mod, ever even playing it too, so hopefully we do pretty well here. I kind of like how Biko's doing on the top of the speakers right there. They're always swinging his arms pretty fast, not gonna lie. Though I kind of like the animation too. What do you guys think about the animation? Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys are enjoying the animation and also maybe even the mod too. Maybe some of you guys actually have heard of the Lavender mod before. And yeah, those Step Mania arrows, especially on the right version that our opponent is using, they look really clean, dude. I really like those new arrow styles as well, especially the trail effect. I think the trail effect is definitely the big distinction factor of the new wide step arrows, you know? Of the new white step mania arrows, like they look really cool. Looks like Biko switched to emotes over there. Now he's got the now he's got the DJ Tiki one right there. That's, there you go. This one's really easy to start things off with here. It's really really easy. It's pretty slow. I mean, for me personally, it might this actually might be one of the first songs in the mod to be honest. But I'm not really sure. It could be honestly. It's a really nice song though. It's very fun to play. The charting spot on, especially for a nice and you know not so difficult first song as well. It's really nice, I enjoy it, and the instrumentals are just very... And the instrumentals are also very preppy as well, they're outgoing. 
pretty effortless right there, man. I like that. It's a really great song. And actually, it's not bad. I like that. I would probably give that like an 8 out of 10 for a first song, to be honest. That's really great. The next song we're going to be trying out is going to be Nature on Hard as well. Another two-minute song, so the, this mod doesn't have like very long songs, which is okay. Some of the songs, even if they're short, some of them can actually be really fun to play as well. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You don't need very long songs for a mod to be enjoyable. Sometimes these nice and short, preppy songs are all you need for, you know, fun songs here. This was another very outgoing song as well. I could definitely rock my head out to the beat right here, dude. It's definitely a nice rocking beat dug in. Just outgoing songs, man. It just gets you in that positive vibe. You know what I'm saying? It's great stuff. Go, be, go, go, man. And he's also rocking those new com those new step arrows too. I keep calling them chameleon arrows, even though they're not even chameleon arrows. They actually step mania arrows. I really gotta stop doing that. It's like a bad habit. I don't know about you guys, but this song kind of like I don't know. It just sounds so peaceful to the point where it sounds like more like a romantic song more than anything. I could be wrong though. Now this part definitely is a little bit different. It's like a little different. Uh. It's a little bit of a different pitch and it's also a little bit of a different pace as well here. But that's probably because it's towards the end of the outro, you know what I mean? So things are definitely gonna slow down towards the end of the songs here. Yeah, there you go, man. I like that. Are there gonna be any extra notes towards the end? I'm pretty sure they're not gonna, there's not gonna be any extra notes at the end right there, but another peaceful song. So far, this mod's been very, very peaceful and outgoing. I like that. And then we do have our last song that we'll be trying from this mod, and that's gonna be Deem Natura. Now, I have no idea what this song name even means. It might mean, it might have a meaning, it might not even have a meaning at all. It sounds pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Listen to this intro, this is definitely a fast song right here. Here we go. Now we're getting into the meat of the mod. Now we're getting into like the actual hard stuff right here. It's a lot faster than the previous other two songs right here. Yeah, this guy's spazzing out too. He's not lying about that. Look at Gal go, bro. Oh man, dude. Poor guy's having like a seizure or something. My gosh, dude. There is some jacks in this one though, so you guys definitely gotta practice up your jacks, especially if you wanna play the song pretty well here. So I would probably recommend playing some uh, ballistic or something if you wanna get better at jacks and stuff like that. Like, jeez, man. Some pretty hard sections in here, not gonna lie. Though it's a short song. A little part right there. It's like an S curve, but with the arrows right there. That's pretty cool. We got almost a 200 combo at the moment too. We're doing pretty good so far, especially holding our ground down here, man. I like this last song the best, I think, because this last song definitely has the more fun charting compared to the other two songs. I would say that's just because I like faster songs in general. You know, more of a challenge and stuff like that. Like, don't get me wrong, slow songs are good and all, like especially for newer players, but. For most players on Funky Friday, I feel like they want to see more hotter songs, just like this last song right here. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this update video, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, because I do I do cover every single update on Funky Friday. Don't forget to subscribe, be start code attack. We'll see you later.